What's up? Matt here from Merch Fab. Doing a little video today on how to cut perfect circles or hoops with plasma cutter um, using a highly advanced technical piece of equipment of a piece of 3mm with various holes drilled in it and one small nut and bolt. That's all you need. Um, you need a plasma cutter. This is mine, it's a Artec 50 amp. No, it's a beast. It'll cut through that 10 mil like it's nothing. Alright, so I'm just going to mark out the centre, I'm just going to cut one out of this piece of scrap. So I'm going to drill a little hole in the centre. So these holes are the, exactly the same size as the tip on the end of there. So what's and then get in the way is I'm going to clamp that like that obviously that's going to hit so I'll have to do go around as far as I can and then swap the clamp over the other side to finish it off but I'll do one on the inside one on the outside and that will leave us like the hoop around the edge which is what I would normally use so um That got perfect outside circle. Now I'm going to go around, cut the inner one. I'm just cut into my cable. So don't do that.
that's it. How to cut yourself a circle or hoop or anytime you need a perfect curved edge for something that you need to plasma cut out. It takes much less clean up when you've got a guide, something to run it along. Um, if you're freehanding with a plasma cutter, unless you're really good at it, I find it takes so much time to clean up what you've just cut that um, I normally just use a grinder. So um, This way is you get a really nice finish. There's a bit of a step in it there where it slipped, but that was just where I had to uh, move the clamp twice. If you are doing it on a big piece and you've got enough space to swing the whole way around, then you're going to end up with a better finish than that. But that's pretty good. It's good enough if you're going to weld all the way around. Top and the bottom, that's what I would do. Um, I'll put some pictures up of what I normally use these for. Um, that's about it. I hope that helps a few people out. And um, check out my other videos. Um, thanks for watching.